Hey everyone, SPFellas4 here. We're back with another video. It's the 18th edition of the Girls Band Party Station live stream, and as usual, I'm always here to summarize these videos for you fine people on the internet and talk about the upcoming updates in Bang Dreams uh, Japanese server. In particular, these updates are mostly focused on the Christmas and New Year's um, events that will be happening, which is not too much news, but regardless, there's some very exciting updates to come. So as always, if you enjoy this content and want to see more like this in the future, feel free to like the video, a comment, on your favorite update to come and subscribe to the channel. All that support is greatly appreciated. So uh, let's get right into it. There's a few things we do want to cover. So right off the bat, there's quite a few news with regards to upcoming CDs and a lot of merchandise for the Christmas holiday. I'm not going to really focus too much on that in this video. My main focus is going to be about the game itself. So on Christmas Day, um, anyone who logs into JP Dory will get uh, 250 stars and a Christmas cake, um, which is sort of like a uh, energy boosting uh, item. This is kind of like the usual uh, trend that we have in Christmas, so definitely remember to log in. Between uh, Christmas Eve and New Year's Eve, you also get a chance to do one free one pull per day, so up to seven pulls in total. So again, this is not a 10 pull, it's just one pull. A little bit underwhelming, but maybe in the seven pulls, you'll get something good. So we'll see if anyone's gacha luck is very solid. And as per tradition, we always have a cover song for Christmas uh, that gets added to the game. This time will be Afterglow covering the song Konayuki, from uh, the artist is Remio Roman. Um, so this will be added into the game on Christmas Eve as well. All right, so this is the year-end login campaign. So between uh, December 26th, which is Boxing Day here in Canada, all the way to uh, December 31st, um, if you log in every day, you'll get 50 stars as well as 10 tone crystals per day. So that's up to 300 stars and 60 tone crystals if you, in total if you log in once during this period. You'll also be able to snag some pins for your uh, Bandai profile. This one's specific to uh, the Maigo characters. So here we have Tomori, Anon, Soyo, and Taki. So definitely remember to log in between this period in order to grab these pins for your profile. As usual, there's always going to be that uh, year-end uh, celebration to start the new year. If you choose your favorite band and click on it, then you'll get a card from them uh, to celebrate the new year. So you'd be able to uh, sort of punch in which band you want uh, a new year's card from between December 26th and December 31st. And then on the New Year's Day, that's when the card will be revealed and shown to you. As with the usual uh, New Year celebrations, uh, when you play a multi-live or any live between December 26th and January 16th, you'll be able to get additional currency, uh, the 2023-2024 sort of uh, Emma uh, currency and you could use that to exchange for various prizes including as you can see uh, pins of the various uh, drummers there's also more uh, live boosting items like a christmas cake a new year's cake um, there's the gacha tickets and some various other uh, items so definitely check that out and make sure you play in order to get these prizes so between January 1st, 2nd, and 3rd, you'll be get a fortune-telling uh, sort of charm uh, some ticket to show how lucky you'll be. This is a very common Japanese tradition, and these will feature two uh, of the Bandari characters at random that will uh, congratulate you on what kind of luck or fortune that you'll have uh, starting in 2024. So we'll see if uh, you'll get anyone that you like, and of course you get skill tickets of that particular character that will be picked out at random. To celebrate the new year, there will also be some additional pins that you can add to your collection. If you log in between January 1st and January 10th, uh, there are eight of these individuals that are using like the miscellaneous um, uh, sort of instruments, either keyboard or um, violin, and in this case, right? So uh, definitely make sure you log in and add these lovely pins to your collection as well. So if you thought the Christmas polls were a little bit disappointing, fret not. Um, the New Year's polls are much better because uh, if you have a chance to log in between January 1st and January 10th, you could do a free 10 pull um, once a day. And this will be up to 70 times. Uh, so just make sure that within a 10 day period, you do the free uh, 10 times 7 pulls. So this will be up to 70. So in total, 77 pulls uh, free in total between now and the uh, new year and going into 2024. So we'll see if anyone gets some good pulls there. 
Next, let's talk about songs. There's a lot of songs that are going to be added as part of the end of the year, start of the year situation. So let's have a look here. Uh, first of all, on uh, December 31st, Flame of Hope, the 3D Live, will be added into the game. This is definitely a very popular Morphonica song, so this will be something I'm really looking forward to. You can already see the flames in the background. I think this will be really cool to see. Now, on Bandere's official social media platforms, they shared hints of the eight new covers that will be added into the game uh, in this period of time. And there's these hints with these emojis. And I think a lot of people already figured out most of these quite well. Now, I'm not sure if any of you who haven't seen the, the covers yet, maybe you're not really sure what they are. So maybe uh, pause on this video right here, take a guess and take a stab of what you think the, the songs might be. And then we'll reveal them very shortly, like right now. So uh, songs start getting added into the game on December 26th, where Hella Happy World's cover of Kyo Fu All Back, a uh, song by Yuko P, will be first added into the game. This is a very iconic song. You know, the girl with the backpack and walking through the wind. Um, so this is, I think, a perfect fit for Hella Happy World. Uh, we'll see how this song goes. This will, again, will be the first song added into the game as part of this mega cover uh, collection. Next song here is Dai Zero Kan. Uh, this is a song by Ten Feet, and this is the opening or one of the uh, songs to the first Slam Dunk, a very old uh, but iconic anime. So Razor Sun and going back a bit more on the old style, and this will be uh, released on December 27th. Next, on December 28th, Morphonica will be making a cover of the very famous Overdose song from Natori. Um, this is a pretty good song. I quite enjoy it. So I'm really excited to see how the violin will go with the sort of more casual vibes on this. So again, this will be the third song added to the game um, in this cover sort of period. Maigo is coming up next on the fourth cover on December 29th. They'll be releasing the cover of White Noise. Uh, this is the opening to Tokyo Revenge. Avengers, um, and I believe this is another official Higedanism song. So this is pretty exciting. Another uh, pretty interesting uh, shonen opening that's relatively recent that's going to be added uh, into the game. Next, on December 30th, Afterglow is going to be the co uh, covering the Blue Lock opening, which I think from the emojis really was obvious. Um, it is going to be Kaoska Kimawaru. Kimawaru. Um, so that is going to be another song that will be added to the game. And once again, uh, another uh, sort of shonen and anime OP. So I'm pretty excited to see how this goes. To wrap up 2023, Roselia's cover of Slash, which is a song by Yama, and this is the second opening of Witch for Mercury, a Mobile Suit Gundam, of course. Um, so this is probably out of the, the, the eight songs. I think this is the one I'm most looking forward to. Um, the Slash is a great song. Um, I'm really looking forward to it. And of course, it's Roselia, so a little bit biased here, but uh, that will be the last song of 2023 in the, in the covers that will be added. To kick off the new year, um, Pop and Party on January 1st will be covering Watashi wa Saiko or I'm Invincible. This is the Ado Saw that was also featured in the One Piece film Red li um, live movie, or not really live, but it's just a movie. Uh, <laughs> so um, this is the second song uh, from that movie, so pretty exciting there. Um, I'm pretty curious to see how Pop and Party will cover this. Uh, Ado, of course, is a very strong voice, so let's see how Pop and Party does here. Last but certainly not least, Pasta Palettes will be covering Pinocchio P's Magical Girl and Chocolate, and this will be uh, added to the game on January 2nd. And this will be again another song where Maishima Ami should be back again and, and singing. She's already sang, I think, a couple of songs already since her return, but I'm also always looking forward to hearing her voice once again. So these are all the cover songs that will be added in this period of time. One other quick note here is that John, this John guy, is going to uh, share a song called Goodbye. Um, and this is going to be using the Roselia synthesizer, the AI synthesizer, and that will be released in the game on uh, January 3rd. And this will be the last song that will be added into the game as part of uh, this sort of campaign of adding new songs. So here's a, a quick summary of all the 10 songs that will be added into the game, uh, going from Christmas Eve all the way to the start of New Year. So these next two weeks are going to be pretty exciting. Let me know again in the comments below which song you're most looking forward to. All right, we'll end off today's video by talking about the upcoming Hololive collab with Bandary once again. This is sort of the second part, part two. So it's like a, it's like second part, part two. It's like kind of both together. But on December 23rd, um, the gacha for this uh, second part of the Hololive collab will begin uh, featuring Roselia collaborating with uh, Sakamata, Chloe, and of course, Reza Suilin collabing with Hoshimachi Suisei. So uh, of course, big Hololive fans out there would probably be very excited to see these two 
two really popular um, Hololive uh, members now being featured in this collaboration with Mandarin. In celebration of this collaboration, we'll have a couple of songs that will be covered by the uh, you know collaborative members in question. Uh, so Chloe and Roselia will be covering the song Marionette. And this is um, a Deco 27 song. And again, the MV, there'll be an MV with it too. It'll be added to the game on December 23rd alongside the Gacha. And of course, uh, we can't have Suisei without her own song. So uh, she, she and Reza Sula will be covering Stellar Stellar uh, together as an extra song. Also be added to the game on December 23rd. And again, there will also be an MV as well. So you got to see the collaborative um, sort of outfits for both uh, both uh, Chloe and Suisei with uh, Roselia and Reza Sula. So this is pretty exciting. Um, but again, there's no event associated with this collab. It's simply um, just add extra additions of the Cololab collab with the costumes and the songs. The MVs of these particular songs, I believe in the full version, will be uploaded onto the official YouTube channel. Uh, Chloe's song on December 27th and Suisei's on December 28th. So definitely look forward to that. And of course, don't forget to log in in order to get extra stickers for the collab from Yukina, Chloe, as well as Suisei and Layer. And of course, also get 500 stars as well. So just make sure you log in. Uh, most people are going to be logging in anyway during the Christmas time and the New Year. So this will be sort of an extra bonus uh, to that. So after you play a live, you'll get these whole life picks and you'll be able to use this uh, drop to exchange for these pins, these new pins for Yukina, uh, Koloi, as well as Layer Suisei. So make sure you collect those and get those pins. And then, of course, you could use that to exchange for other things like the Miracle Crystals, the Gacha Tickets, etc. There's also some missions that you'll be able to unlock in order to get these titles for uh, Yukina Chloe as well as uh, Suisei Layer. So definitely make sure you complete those missions in order to get these exclusive titles. So, so this looks like a situation where, but for a certain period of time, this uh, song will also be uh, available for a limited period of time in order to play. And you can play from the home menu. Um, so this is, has its own special room, kind of like how we had the, the Fripp side only my railgun before. Um, this is another situation, but with the whole alive instead. Uh, so this is a chance for you to kind of on the side play it for a limited period of time. All right, so that's all for today. This should be a relatively short video, but I haven't edited it yet, so we'll see how long it will be. Uh, but uh, let me know in the comments below, guys, what you are most excited for. Are you big a whole of life fan and you want to see more of that collab? Or maybe the cover songs that you see upcoming are you're something you're most looking forward to? Uh, let me know. And of course, like the video if you liked what you see. A comment below, again, your favorite uh, update to come. And subscribe to the channel if you want to see more uh, content like this. All that support is greatly appreciated. So uh, with that, folks, we will end off today's video and thank you again for watching. So hope to see you in the next time and Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays to everyone watching. We'll see you all in the new year. Take care.